<laughs> well, <laughs> hopefully a smile to. on your face this morning with a uh, beautiful start to the day, as you can see by this look north from the old milk camera. <laughs> We've got fair skies in the north, some clouds moving into the south. Those will continue to increase. And the temperature in Salt Lake of 60 degrees. So uh, feels pretty comfortable if you're just now heading out for your morning walk. A lot cooler, though, in Logan, 41. Even colder in Ely at 39, but in the far south, St. George, you're starting out at 71. Now, high pressure is centered over Texas, and that's going to dominate our weather pattern here in Utah because the circulation around that is allowing a southerly flow to become more pronounced, and that's tapping into monsoonal moisture over the desert southwest. That's making its way north, and we'll bring a chance of some showers and thunderstorms today, mainly over central and southern Utah, although... Uh, it looks like most of those would be east of I-15, south of Highway 6, so they're most likely over the southeast corner of the state. But with the possibility of those, there is a possibility of flash flooding at the national parks and recreation areas today, so keep an eye on the sky if you have outdoor plans in those areas and uh, be ready to avoid trouble spots like slot canyons. Now in Salt Lake, we'll start out sunny, become partly cloudy, we'll warm up to 91, so about five degrees higher than yesterday. And in general, partly cloudy over the north today, well over central and southern Utah, it'll become mostly cloudy after getting some sunshine early in the day, and also some areas of smoke near Bryce Canyon, southwest Utah, and even up into some of the central valleys. And that chance of some of the showers and thunderstorms later on. Those are possible again tomorrow, but not as likely in St. George, uh, where you still have some patchy smoke. You'll dry out on Friday, become mostly sunny this weekend, and get a little bit hotter with the temperature climbing just above 100 by then. And in northern Utah, it's going to be another warm day in Salt Lake tomorrow. We'll be in the low 90s, but it'll be partly cloudy with a chance of some showers and thunderstorms by late in the day, overnight, and into early Friday. But it looks like we will dry out in time for the weekend. Sunny on Saturday with a high of 93, mid-90s by Sunday, and by next Tuesday, we'll make it all the way up near 100 degrees.